Hello, this is Mr. Kenyon Nola, and I'm going to help you find the indicated angles. Uh, so, for some of you guys, uh, you see this problem, and it's four angles that you need to find, and there's all these lines, and then you just, your brain automatically shuts off. Don't shut off, okay? Stay on. Um, and I'm gonna help you figure this out. It's not too bad, um, so just, just focus and stay calm and breathe and I'll help you get through this. So uh, let's figure out uh, what angle one is. Well, first thing is it doesn't say that this is uh, the center. So that doesn't mean that this angle right here is 124. So no central angles, uh, but um, yeah. So let's start off with angle one. Uh, if you guys notice that angle one is made by this tangent line and this cord and this tangent line and this cord right here is eating is intercepting this arc right here so uh, we're going to take figure out what the measure of this entire arc is so use our trusty calculator 124 plus 70 which is 194. Uh, so this arc is 194, but remember the, the angles that are made by lines are half the measure of the arc because a line and a circle are half, so the, the line's half. So we're gonna take this 194 and divide it by two and make that, and find that it's 97 degrees. So angle one is 97 degrees. We could figure out angle two fairly easily uh, because that because this is a line that means that these two angles are here are supplementary or a linear pair so these two angles add up to 180 degrees don't say these angles equal 180 degrees because this doesn't equal 180 this equals 97 but the two of them together add up so what we're going to do is take our calculator and type in 180 and subtract 97 from it and it's 83 so angle 2 is 83 degrees all right now uh let's figure out some other things uh angle 4 okay let's skip angle 3 for now it's not that i don't think angle 3 is special but i think angle 4 it'll be a little easier to figure out so these two lines intersect in the middle of this, uh, not in the middle, but inside the circle. We don't know it's directly in the middle, but somewhere inside the circle. And so um, angle four, uh, it's, it intercepts this arc right here, this 110, and it's vertical angle intercepts this 124. So if you guys remember the formula uh, for the intersecting lines inside of a circle um, formula. So what you do to figure out that angle is you take one of the arcs, 110. You find the sum of it with the other arc, which is 124. And you actually get the average of those two arcs. Okay, so we're going to do 110 plus 124 and divided by two, which is 117 degrees. So angle four is 117 degrees. And look at that. Angle three is supplementary to angle four. So this is why we waited for angle three to be last. Uh, so we're gonna take our calculator and do 180 minus 117. And angle three is 63 degrees. So 60 equals 63 degrees and there you go that's how you figure out the four uh angles indicated angles not too bad all right have a great day bye